welcome back to Googie's Kitchen and if you are new here then hello and welcome. My name is Alexis and this is Ted and today we want to show you how to make our delicious pineapple and mint chock chip ice cream. So as I just mentioned today I'm going to be making our favourite pineapple and mint chock chip ice cream. Yeah and I Ted really and I, really like it. Yeah, Ted and I aren't really fans of synthetic mint, so things like mint chocolates we don't really like. I don't like I don't like the mint chocolate chip ice cream from the ice cream man that. No, like but we like fresh mint, so we really like the taste of fresh mint, and this is one we absolutely love. And I really love the smell. So, we're going to make some today, because the weather is meant to be getting warmer this week, yep. so we thought it would be a perfect time to make some ice cream. We're making it again. So, while we were making it, we thought we'd share the recipe with you. Again. So, here is how to make our delicious pineapple and mint chop chip ice cream. So for this recipe you're only going to need five ingredients and that is it. So you're going to need a tin of coconut milk and that's your base for the ice cream. Mint you, of course. Mint. We've got some pineapple here. We're using fri frozen pineapple but you could use fresh if you wanted to. Yeah. And then I also have some maple syrup here as well. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to empty the contents. Oh can I do it? Can I do it? All right. Yeah. Oh, look. Of the coconut milk, careful because the water will come out. Okay, you do it. Whoa! That, that went fast! Um, so we're going to empty the contents of oh, this the into our neutral bullet, like so. Do you want to put the mint in while I do this? Oh, too? yeah. So, Tilly's now going to put the mint in. Do I put the sticks in? Yeah, you can do. You can eat the sticks as well, they're edible. The plus, they'll be always that in the Nutribullet as well. Yes, so. you can't want to see them. Yeah. So we'll put the coconut milk in. Then I've got some pineapple here, and I'm just going to put a couple of handfuls in, like so. And just some mint at the top. Yeah, okay. Pineapple mint. And then we're going to put the chopped chips in later, but we're also going to add two tablespoons of um, maple syrup to this as well. Oh, just to give it a little bit of sweetness. Oh no, I won't have to do that. Yeah. Right. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to blend all of these ingredients together. Yeah. ingredients together and we have this smoothie now and now what we're going to do is we are going to pour the smoothie into a um, plastic container so this is going to be our ice cream tub yep. and then we're going to put this into the freezer for probably a couple of hours and then we'll pull it back out and blend it again and we'll do we'll repeat this process twice and then on the last go we'll add the chop chips but we'll show you that later so, the <laughs> ice cream has been in the freezer for a good wow. two hours now and what we're going to do is we are going to put... And that's a bit melted. Yeah. All that's of... Wow. Oh. <laughs> all all of it, it except a few bits. <laughs> into the... <laughs> oh my god. We'll just pick that up, no one will know. That's clean there by the way. We're only going to eat it. And then what we're going to do is we are going to put the cut lid on and we're going to blend this again. Can I blend it again? Yep, you can. The top is a bit dirty. Right, so bye guys, see you in a bit. So that's blended again and now what we're going to do is we are going to pour this back into the ice cream container. And now and we're going to put the chocolate chips in. No, we are going to put it back into the freezer. Oh. And we'll do it one more time and then we'll put the chopped chips so in. Let's take it in then. Yeah, put the chopped chips What's in. What's the point in freezing it two times? Because it makes it more smooth and creamy to when you eat it. And just blend it again. Okay. So yes, we're gonna put this back into the freezer now. Right. I'm not gonna blitz it. So we aren't gonna blitz it for the third time. We're just gonna mix the ice cream and then what we're going to do is we pour are... the chopped chips. Yep, yeah, we're going to put the chopped chips in. So do you want to pour those in, sweetheart? Let's pour them in. And I'll keep 
mixing while you pour them in. So we get them evenly spread throughout the ice cream. I'm just going to try and get some of um, still, no, still, still, you can put a few more in too, Tom. I'm still something to tell. Oh, and you just want to eat them, don't you? So, enough? A bit more. Right, so that's all well mixed in now. And we're going well, to put it, this bye. back into the freezer. And we're going to leave it in there overnight and then we're going to have some tomorrow, yeah. aren't we? We'll show you when we eat it. Yeah. Bye. Bye. So, we left the ice cream to freeze overnight and now what we're going to do is we're going to serve it. But we took this out about an hour before we're actually going to serve it because it does need that long to defrost. Depending on the weather and how hot it is. Yeah. If it's a really warm day, it'll probably need less time. But yeah, we're just going to serve this now, and then we're just going to have some of this for a little Oh, I steal a few chocolate chips. Oh! I steal a few chocolate chips. <sighs> so yes, that is how you make this ice cream. So that's how you make my delicious pineapple and mint choc chip ice cream. And that recipe, I will link in the description box below for you. But for now, that's it from us. Thank you so much for watching. Please feel free to give us a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And please feel free to leave any comments below. And please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you all soon. Bye.